Hi folks, Baz a Garage Strongman. It's chest day today. I'm going to do something a little bit different. If you've reached a plateau on your bench press, there's a few things you can do to break through that. And I'm going to give you some tips today. Um, this has come about basically because I didn't do my chin-ups yesterday, didn't do my lats. And as I thought, I'll introduce them today. I'll do some supersets which is always a good thing, superset in chest and lats. But it got me thinking that I could do a little section on breaking through those plateaus. And what I propose is changing things up a little bit to your normal routine. I've got some supersets such as the chin-ups onto bench press or dumbbells as I'm gonna do today. And I've also got another superset that goes from flies to presses. And then I'm going to talk about hitting the triceps, which is obviously plays a big part in your bench press. Please enjoy. Right, I'm supersetting dumbbell bench press with chin-ups, pull-ups, variations of hand positions. Different to normal, I'm going to do the chin-ups first. I'm going to stop short of failure by a rep or two, and then I'm going to jump straight on to the dumbbell bench press, which is quite light. I just got 30k dumbbells. And the idea is that I'm really going to wake up the lats and then get them more involved on the bench. Here it goes. So I'm going to do those presses very slowly and I'm really trying to contract the lats, trying to get them involved. Okay, set two now. I'm going to change my hand position on the chin-ups. Um, slightly narrower and an angled hand position. I'm going to stick with the same dumbbells. What I'm going to try and do is go even slower really focusing on the lats and I'm going to try to get them to do the press as much as possible. Try and take the emphasis off my chest. Obviously it's going to get involved and do most of the heavy lifting, but I'm really focusing on working those lats in a different way or in conjunction with the bench press. That's good, I can really feel them working. It's almost a slightly different position. I'm almost trying to trying to like wing it up. Okay, probably my last one of these. My lats are really fried, they're really working hard. Um, it's by no means a fly. I'm not doing that at all. It's still a press, but the way I'm tensing the lats, it just feels different. It feels, I suppose it feels to the lats like it's doing a fly, if you know what I mean. So that tension, 
but I am pressing straight up. Narrow grip now, hands facing. Press is feeling a lot harder than it normally would with that weight. My chest is isn't feeling as involved. Something's definitely happening. The lats are doing some of the work at least, and they're pretty fried now. Okay, to shift the emphasis back to the chest now, I'm going to do some fly to press supersets. I'm going with the 30k dumbbells, although I think these are a little bit heavy for the fly. So I might not get the full range of movement for risk of snapping something off. But we'll give it a go for this first set. And I'm on an incline 30 degrees. Just to shift up to the sort of top part of the chest. Flies. Push. I was hoping to not have to change dumbbells, but I'm going to have to probably start with the 18s. So apologies for that last set, they were too heavy. Um, my spotter's got, got my 20s over his house, so and my adjustables are set up heavy, so pretty stupid, really. I'm going to have to use the 18s. Um, 18s for flies and the 30s for presses, so I have to swap. Always check your weights, folks. Always make sure, especially when you're in a public gym, you don't just jump on and Try and do what the last person was doing. Check the weights, make sure they're right for you. Avoid injury. We have that full range of movement. Oh. Fix those elbows. And it's like hugging a big tree. Your arms go right and around. Okay, I did another set of those, the supersets. Now my chest is feeling pretty pumped. I'm going to finish off the triceps. I haven't done that much work today. So I'm going to start with the straight arm. It's not straight arm. Straight bar. It's nice and light. Make sure you're stood under the bar and you're pushing straight down. You don't want to be leaning in and using any shoulders or anything like that. You see people doing with too much weight. Just have the triceps do the work from there to there.
Oh, I haven't done in for a while. It's feeling pretty tough. It's only 20 kilos. Second set now up to 30 kilos. Got a bit weak on that right i normally go up to 40k on this but i'm not feeling it today i'm feeling pretty weak and i don't know what that's about i haven't done this exercise for a while but i have been doing tricep work um maybe just the heat and i'm dehydrated a bit but anyway i'm gonna have to double my efforts on this so i'm gonna do a drop set to finish off I've got the 30k on there. I'm looking for about, I don't know, about six reps. And I'm going to whip off the fives and do a set on 20k straight, straight after. Here we go. me done for the day then folks if you've liked my video please drop us a thumbs up and please subscribe for future strongman content i'm baz agavish strongman see you soon